Hey, gender blunders. Uh, good morning. Um, it is the god awful early hour of 10 to 9 in the morning here, Friday, April 17th. I know for some of you this isn't early, and really for me it's not, but when it's a Friday and it's my day off, and I don't have any school to get up for, it's extremely early. But, gotta make the video for you guys, because uh, I'm heading off to Maryland for the weekend. So this week's topic is, uh, it was suggested, it was asked by one of our viewers, and uh, she wanted to my tie is playing with a piece of paper and uh, it was asked by one of our viewers and she wanted to know um, she's planning on coming out to one of her friends and wanted to know our experiences how we did it um, and the responses that we got um, the first person I came out to actually um, sort of like you could sort of kind of say outed me but um, it wasn't a bad thing. Um, she had, it was a good friend of mine, and, uh, she was standing a trans guy at the time, and we would just talk about it, and she'd talk about him, and, you know, we'd talk about it, like I said. <laughs> um, and, um, just one out of, out of the blue, she was like, she just was like, well, you're trans, right? And I was kind of like, oh, huh, shit, well, can't lie. So yeah, but she's awesome. <clears throat> um, I don't know if she watches my videos. If you do, then you know who you are. Um, um, all my other friends, like but the friends, my immediate friends that are like that I live with, um, they were awesome about it. They were kind of like, well, that's why we always saw you like. You were always in like the guy friend category as opposed to all the, the girlfriend category. Um, and most of my friends are lesbians, but uh, I guess I was lucky enough that they were they were just like, oh yeah, well yeah, you know, you're you, so whatever. Um, even um, as um, even like my friend Scotty, he's pretty cool with it. Um, he's amazing with it. He thinks it's awesome. Um, Um, let's see, I had one friend who was very con concerned when I came out to her, um, she's actually who I'm going to visit today, heading to Maryland to see, um, she, you know, asked a few questions and was like, are you sure about this, and blah blah blah, but it's not because she's against it, it's because she cares about me, and we're, you know, she wants to make sure I'm happy and I'm not, you know, putting myself in a position to make myself unhappy or whatever. Um, she's a very caring individual. Um, one of my best friends. And I sort of expect I expected that response from her because that's the kind of a person that she is. Um, let me see. My, uh, my supervisor and my manager now. Um, my supervisor is just really awesome. She's very open um, and accepting. Um, when I told her, she was just like, cool. And we talk about it, like, at work. <laughs> when we're bored, we talk about it. And it's sort of like, when I go out with her, like, um, because she's straight, so she, she's sort of the straight world for me. Like, I have the gay world that I go out and do, and then the straight world. And, um, so with her, it's sort of like, her friends don't know. So it's sort of like an inside joke, if you could say an inside joke. But you know, like, I don't know, some people will say something and we'll kind of look at each other and just like laugh. Um, it's not a bad thing. And then, um, my manager knows. <laughs> she thinks it's awesome. She's gay, so she's all open too, so I mean, it's good for when I have to come out at work, so I think I mentioned that uh, in the previous topic of coming out to at work. Um, the only person that I really had that I might have had an issue with, um, my friend who's in the Navy, 
Um, we don't talk that often. Um, uh, every once in a while we'll chat on AIM. And not too long ago, you know, we were talking and, you know, he asked me what else is new and, you know, I'm like, I'm not gonna lie. Because I do want to go down and visit him. I mean, he's in freaking Virginia Beach. Like, if I get a chance to go down there, like, I'm definitely going to. So, um, he's just kind of like, I don't know if it was a bad reaction or not. He, um, like, after I told him, he asked a couple questions and then kind of was just like, oh, you know, I have to go and signed off. So I don't know if, because usually we end our conversation sort of short and, you know, kind of abrupt, but, um, I'm not sure if, I'm just not sure of what he was really thinking because I couldn't see his face, I couldn't see his reaction to it. So that might be one of the only negative reactions to telling friends. I pretty much just told them, um, the ones that are close, to, you know, that I live with. I felt it would, be, you know, I'm lying to them if I'm not telling them, you know. I mean, I waited until I was, you know, super comfortable with the idea and had transition plans and, you know, had done enough research to satisfy myself so that if they did ask questions, I could answer them uh, with no problems. Oh, uh, you have to pardon me. I have a sinus infection, so... <coughs> <coughs> yeah. Lovely. Yay, allergies. Um... But... Uh, I think that's like all the friends that I told so far. I'm in no rush to tell everybody. Like, I have friends from back in Connecticut from like high school and stuff. But... If I'm not going to see them, if I'm not seeing them, I, like, I don't see them often, so I'll tell them when I need to tell them, like, if I get hormones and I start hormones, then I'm going to let them know, but I just, I'm sort of just letting people know on a sort of need-to-know basis. Not, no, that sounds wrong, but I'm just letting people know as I go along, um, and you know what, if someone, if someone doesn't want to be my friend, um, for it, then oh well, because if they can't like me for all of me, then it's not worth it. So yeah, um, that's pretty much how I came out to my friends, how I am coming out to my friends, um, I don't really know how I plan to do it with my other friends, I'll probably shoot them an email or write them a message, send them a message somewhere, but that's really it. I really won't know how I'm going to go about it until, you know, it's time for the rest of the people. So, all right, take care. Have a good day and have a great weekend. I'll see you guys next Friday.